Documentary of Leonidas. Leonidas was born in 540 BC in Sparta. Leonidas' dad was Onyxandrides, who was king of Sparta. Growing up as a child, Leonidas has been trained mentally and physically to become a hopeless warrior. Leonidas had two older brothers. One was Dorius and one was Celebrotius. One of the oldest, Celebrotius, was mentally handicapped and once took throne, died 487 BC. When Dorius took throne, Leonidas did as well. And according to the Spartan tradition, in partnership, Leonidas and Dorius was both king at this time. Once Leonidas took throne, he took the most important position, commander of the Spartan army. After a few years, Leonidas got married to Gora, who became Queen of Sparta, and soon after had a child named Persecutus. For 20 years previously, Greek states were getting attacked. Greeks managed to defeat King Darius, the Persian army at Marathon in 490 BC, with the help from other Greek states like Athens. King Darius wants revenge on Athens for helping the Ionians, so the Athens asked for the Spartans' help to, battle, to fight in the Battle of Thermopylae. The Battle of Thermopylae started in 480 BC. The Battle of Thermopylae lasted for three days. For the first two days, Leonidas and the Greeks were able to hold off 180,000 Persian soldiers. On the third day of the Battle of Thermopylae, a Greek trader passes to tell Xerxes a trail that might help beat the Spartans. After the surprise, Leonidas sends back six to 7,000 Greeks to defend their city-states, left fighting 200 to 300 Spartans. Leonidas died in 480 BC in Thermopylae was showed to be the finest warrior and lead the finest army in ancient Greek has possibly known. Welcome everyone to GIT with your host, Isha Joshi. Welcome to Greek Interview Talk. Today we're here live in 499 BC with King Leonidas, and we're going to ask him some questions about what it takes to be himself and what it takes to be a Spartan. So Leonidas, tell us, what does a king have to deal with? Basically, has to deal with. Uh, he wants to take a larger army there, but he has to deal with you know outdated traditions, and corruption within the, the, the council and the ephors, who I guess are like the Supreme Court. What is the essence of being Leonidas? Is the essence of Leonidas that he would die for any one of his men? If you're not going to go away, then let's fight. It's great to know you, Leonidas. Now tell us, what does it take to be a Spartan? What a Spartan is, and it's very extreme what they went through. And you see, there were no soldiers ever like these guys in the training, the endurance, and the toughness. Thank you, King Leonidas, for joining us on Greek Interview Talk. Hope to see you guys next week when we interview Xerxes to see what he thinks about the Greeks.